Liberty Leading the People is a little bit like, um, it's also kind of a battle scene. So we would go back to the Uccello from the Renaissance with the horses and stuff. And in contrast, so it's a similar kind of thing. It's epic, lots of stuff going on, a kind of battle scene. Here we're getting the ramparts, some of the aftermath. We're getting a lot of uh, the, the tragedy and the realism of this is a real battle. And we have a woman picking up the flag. She's picking up the banner and charging ahead. And it makes us think for a second, what kind of horrible situation does it take for a woman to be leading the charge? How desperate are these people? So he's trying to drive home that this is really, these people are pushed to the absolute edge and they, they, they're, there's no turning back. It's like, there's only one way to go. And um, he's uh, really uh, achieved many things here. The individuality of women, the power of women as a woman doing this. Um, the sense that um, it's not her ego, it's out of for truth. Um, we, we, in later times, can look at this and understand that it's a universal. We don't actually know um, the, the people, what their issue was, whether they're communists or capitalists or whatever it was. We just see that it's an oppressed thing that they're fighting for it. Um, he has littered body, so it's telling you that it's a life or death issue. And then we have her breast exposed, and that gives a sense of purity. Um, a solitary breast also gives a sense of um, a little bit of uh, nurturing. Um, and so we're putting this very feminine woman in a kind of very um, dramatic role because it's necessary. But also those two people, those other, well, all three of them, they're not soldiers. They're the people. So we have a woman, we have a young man, and we have a guy who looks like he's probably a bureaucrat or a business person of some sort. So he's also conveying, these are the people. This is who's suffering. So it's not, a, it's not this intellectual thing of soldiers, you know, fighting each other for property or whatever. There's real people involved here. That's his message he's getting across. So it's, it's, he's taken battle scenes and, and, and evolved it. It's an innovation of making us feel the pain, relate to the characters, um, and, and consequently he's also made it even more dramatic. And he's used to also used several devices. So there's diagonals happening everywhere. There's diagonals of the flag. There's diagonals of her arm. There's a lot of devices there to create drama and intensity. So he's managed to integrate um, many, many elements of the storyline, the, the subject, women's uh, independence, you know, purity, rightness, justice. So he's dealing with a lot of big, big themes, and he, he nailed this.